I'm Yanis Yanguar, and in this video, I'm going to sh well, let's go ahead and uh, check a few tutorials out, actually. Hey, remember uh, in uh, the previous Command & Conquer games, like Red Alert 1 and, and in, like, Red Alert 2, as you can see here, how you can have uh, starting units, and in this case in general, you typically start with your dozer? Well, check this out for size. Looks promising. So first we're going to go and uh, open up our player template.ini and uh, then we're going to go all the way down to our general and we're going to go to the starting uh, unit or we can just go to display name and as you can see there's starting building and as you can see there's a starting unit and a number zero and that'll typically be the dozer but you can actually put starting unit up to 1 and 9 and you can have anything you want to put there. In this case, as you can see, I have boss starting infantry and boss starting tanks. If you've paid attention or been around for my other videos, you might have seen the code for random uh, uh, paradrops for the uh, reinforcement base. So essentially that's exactly what I um, end up creating. I make my own uh, INI file and I made a few uh, objects for um, for random. So I made a starting units for the tanks, infantry, and as you can see I have reinforcements for the tank and boss tank and nuke tank, you know, all that good stuff. Um, you know, that's uh, all, all she wrote really for that one. <laughs> 